So in today's video, I will be sharing with you some of my recent sewing makes and these are just going to be the patterns only. And what will happen is in the next couple of weeks, I will show you what these garments look like actually sewn up. So the first garment is, or the first pattern is McCall's 8011. And I made the jacket that the model is wearing. And I decided that I will say, try to say a little something about each garment. So for this jacket, I will say that it is out of all of these, it is the garment that has the most buttons because there are buttons at the shoulders, at the sleeves, and also down the front. The next pattern is Simplicity 9488. I made the tank top that the model is wearing in yellow. And this is the garment that I would say out of all of these is the most out of season. But because it's a tank, I figured, you know, I can layer it. I can put things on top of it. The next pattern is McCall 7997. I made the blazer dress that the model is wearing. And out of all of these makes, this garment is the one that took me the longest to finish. The next one is McCall's 7967. I made the long knit dress and it has gathers at the sleeve cap. And out of all of these, I would say this was my easiest sewing make. Next is Simplicity 8175. I made the culottes, the little pants there. And this is the one pattern out of all of these that I was like, eh, the, out of the outcome, I wasn't like so, so happy with it. And that's just because they fit a little too big on me. So if I ever make them again, I will have to make some adjustments on the fit. The next one is the Mila Dungarees by Tilly and the Buttons. And I will say that out of all of these, this is my only indie pattern. So I thought that was cool because that was one of my goals this year is to try to sew more indie patterns. The next one is Berta 6249. I made the long garment there that is shown in multicolors. I think it's black, red, and a cream color. And I will say out of all of these, this is the garment that I have worn the most. The last pattern is McCall's 9529. This is a vintage pattern and I made the sweatshirt that is shown there in white. And out of all of these, I will say that this is my most casual make. So yes, like I said, these are all patterns and makes that you will see coming up in the next coming weeks. Before I go, I want to leave you with a love share. So my love share is that individuals who leave the military because of a dishonorable discharge, they are ineligible for all VA benefits. And in many cases, they lose the right to vote. So that was something I learned recently. I wanted to share it with you. Thank you all so very much for watching. And I hope that you look forward to seeing these makes. If you enjoyed this video, I would love to know you can click on the little thumb that's sticking up below.